Hi, welcome. Welcome. This is Tarot Love. We're going to do some tarot. Come on in. It's going to be for Pisces, the collective. Next week is Thanksgiving, so let me just say Happy Thanksgiving. And this is going to be a reading for singles. End of November 2023. So come on in, guys. We're going to take a look at the recent past, current, and what's coming in in the future for singles. Got a lot of... Um, laughing and joking, I think, around your Pisces vibe. It's interesting how people are changing their minds. We're trying to change people's minds by making them laugh and telling jokes and stuff like that. So let's call on spirit together for Pisces, sun, moon, or rising. Maybe their Venus is in Pisces. Anybody dealing with a Pisces? Thank you. And just remember to take what resonates, kind of listen for what resonates. Here we see absolutely happy that someone left, um, that we're no longer tied down to that kind of a vibe. All right. I'm going to clarify. So let's just go ahead and pull that current energy, please. Pisces Collective. Current. I don't know how I feel about love right now. I'm not really willing to invest a lot of time in dating or uh, a love life. Really, my hands are tied for some reason. Somebody's hands could, could possibly be very tied or tied up with something else, with somebody else. We got untied and now we're tied up. So it's just, it's gonna be coming in in the future, please. No longer feeling like walking away, somebody gets something back that was once lost. It could be a person, place, or thing. But it's not about dating. I, I mean, I, I, it's, it's not a date. This isn't a date. Maybe this just isn't a date. Maybe somebody not willing to set a date. We'll see. Okay, and everybody's getting a special card in this segment, so please let me pull that special card for you now, and then I'll clarify. Being very happy that somebody or that something went away, that we walked away, that was a lot of trouble, very troubling situation we got out of and walked away. And we're single and we're Pisces. Sun, moon, or rising. Maybe our Venus is in Pisces, but we're, you know, somebody was getting on someone's nerves. That's that Gemini energy. We had a lot more friendship than we did love anyways. Kind of looks like something went on a little long, just went along with this. Something about going along and not going along. Maybe somebody not getting along. No, it's it was confrontational. Someone was confrontational. Walking away from confrontation, let's clarify. Being overprotective, <clears throat> this just wasn't fair, and someone waited, went along with it, and waited. So now currently, we're burnt out, 
acting tough. And it's, it's just too much. It's too much. Right? Pisces, this is you and your own reading over there on the left. Not knowing how you feel about this person, this situation, you're single, we stuck around with something too much, too long, going along with it, acting tough, it's just too much now, letting go of those feelings in a good way, you know, I have good feelings for you. But, you, but those are your feelings. Um, I also hear someone say that uh, they're coming off as, as, a, as a real jerk. That's that acting tough now, being a jerk. And No confrontation. We don't, this is, this is getting old. We're getting burnt out on this cold hearted. This could be somebody coming off as cold hearted, but just being very disappointed, you know, and thinking that we could have had something or having to disappoint someone because what we see coming in is it's difficult to accept but the sun in reverse, this isn't that. This isn't that. And not willing to see it, someone believing in the illusion of love. They thought this was love. They thought this was love. They thought this was love. All right, let's take a deep breath. Thank you. Please take a minute and tap that like button for me. Again, I'm Tara Love. It really does help my channel. Tap the like button, and if you want to become a member, tap subscribe. Thank you. Thank you for being here. I really appreciate you guys. Um, yeah. Someone believed in the illusion of love. This isn't that, and not willing to see it. Be somebody around you. This could be you. This is very difficult. Um, coming in in the future for somebody to accept. They thought somebody was going to go along with this, but became confrontational. And so we may confront this burnout. He was always acting so tough, very cold hearted, and say it's just, it's too much. This might be difficult to accept, but this isn't that. Pisces Collective and clarification. Well, here we see a very nice conversation coming together. And I think after that conversation, we're just able to really put our single self out there with a really good attitude. Looking for somebody, this could be somebody um, we're looking for with a better attitude. And this is also them saying, why? This is exhausting to deal with this person. Why? Why are you doing this for? Very prepared to have this conversation. Very prepared to engage in this conversation. This could be somebody um, who we can finally actually have a conversation with. Very respectful person, attractive person, and a more mutual understanding. But this is also that person who they thought they found their perfect match. 
and we know that this isn't that so we have to have that conversation and it will end up that this will work out better in the long term if we do have that you know deep conversation with somebody to renew a level of connection to be able to see eye to eye again so we know see eye to eye somebody asks why we just want to be able to see eye to eye because this isn't that and somebody is not willing to see it because they believed in the illusion of love right Pisces totally I mean it's not it's gonna hurt them more than it's gonna hurt you and it's time to leave the hurt behind Leaving that person behind, leaving this behind, taking a calculated risk to open yourself up to fully experience, become free and be able to put yourself out there. And because this is the connection that is struggling, it's we're struggling to make it work. And it's hard to cope with anymore. Somebody doesn't want to cope with it anymore. Um, so we do see a very close, a very, it's an oh so close it's very challenging, close to home, but keep fighting. You've got this, Spirit says. You've got this. All right, Pisces, you've got this. You can do this. The situation might be challenging, but just look at you. I'm just going to find the courage, finding the inner courage to have this conversation. Spirit says, you've got this. Because this isn't your responsibility. This is their responsibility or vice versa. We need to push through this. Because we're just not willing to make any commitments right now. And this isn't that. Okay? All right. Again, this is Tara Love. Thank you for your view. Check back. Bye-bye.